today guys it's going to be an amazing day hopefully guys we can find something great if not as always we've been blessed and we've been blessed with a lot more so guys let's get started with our dumpster diving adventure Looking backpack. Mm. I'll leave this out for someone else. have some stuff here really good. Golden goose. Take four. Alright, extinguisher we have a I'm not sure what that is. I see something with some cellophane wrap around it, you guys. Oh, there's some type of flag that's all messed up. So I'll leave that in there. What else is in here? Mm. All right, you guys, what do we have over here? Frontage. Easy bed. <laughs> Look at that, you guys, we have a easy bed. Oh my goodness, the whole thing is in here too. I'm gonna take it home and I'm gonna see if it's working. All the dirt out. Alright, y'all, let me take this on to the truck. <sighs> we have a table here, you guys on the desk. Oh, the top is off. See some stuff on top of the can here. Some boots. Some old, ugly shoes. These boots can probably still be used. Yeah, these can still be used. Still in pretty good condition. All right, you guys, so I came back to get these vinegars that I left behind. Let me see, did anybody take them? Nope, they didn't. All right, let me go ahead and get them, you guys. Okay guys, we are finally home and here's all the items that we were able to find uh, today as well as the items that I was able to find on Wednesday. All right, so first thing first, you guys, we have this front gate easy bed. I will have to um, take it out of the, the case to see if it is functioning properly. Over here, you guys, we have this really beautiful rock, you guys. 
in the comment section, so many of you guys told me that this is a geoid. I'm going to probably use this as a paperweight in my office or I will put it in my room, um, you know, just because it's so beautiful. Also, you guys, we have all of these belts, you guys. You know that I love dressing up. I love, love, love playing dress up in my closet. I love accessories. And to find all of these amazing belts, you guys, is absolutely phenomenal. I'm so, so grateful. I don't have to go out and buy any. All right. And we have various brands here. This right here is just a no-name brand, but it's a beautiful black belt right there. We also have this pretty black here with the gold embellishment. And this is a, let's see, this is a H&M belt here. Let me ring. Right there, this belt here, you guys. Cute. And then we have this one here. This is a Banana Republic. Pretty off-white color belt here. This beautiful brown belt here, you guys. Another, I believe it's up. Yep, Banana Republic, you guys. And then we have a white one here. Just a regular no-name belt, but that's okay. You know, I'm grateful still. We have this tan H&M belt here. This pretty brown belt here. Again, another Banana Republic right there. You got this one. Then we have this teal color belt here by, I think this is also Banana Republic. Yep, it is Banana Republic. This belt here. Bring this over there. And then we have this really pretty hunter green belt. Another Banana Republic, you guys. This is one of my faves. This pink one with the beautiful gold bow. You guys, this is a no name, but that's okay. And it's reversible, I believe, is it? Let's see if this reversible. I think it is reversible. I don't know. No, it's not reversible. You can tell because of this right here. And then we also have these belts right here, you guys. I love these belts. These are some adjustable belts, you guys, with the gold hook. These are also no-name belts, but that's okay. I absolutely love, love, love these belts, you guys. See that? You have that one. And you also have this beautiful one here as well and then right here you guys we have a container full of hangers i'm excited about these hangers because my Haley bop just told me that she needed more hangers for her clothes over here you guys we have these really cute shoes uh that i will be donating call it spring not my size so again i will be donating those you guys and you guys the find of the day listen you guys i had no idea that honey and vinegar did not expire. I just did not know that, okay? I looked it up and I found out that honey can last 10 years after the expiration date. How cool is that, right? And vinegar also doesn't spoil. However, it will lose its acidity, but that's okay because white vinegar, which I have here, I can use for cleaning as well as my clothes. And if this doesn't taste too good after a certain time, then we can always, you know, just use it for whatever. Again, probably cleaning. And I'm sure it's a lot of different things that you can use vinegar for. So shout out to you guys again um, for blowing up my comment section letting me know that as well as me being able to go online to do the research myself but i was able to find these amazing colossals brand honey you guys we have this one and then we have a different uh flavor in here somewhere can't find it yet but we have variety different varieties of honey i called the company as well to find out if they were on recall and they were not these honeys you guys are not even on the shelf anymore they ran out so i don't know when they will be putting them back um in stock but to find all of this honey you guys is absolutely amazing i wish some of you guys lived in the area i would give you boxes of honey okay because i don't know what antoine and i will do with all of this honey i'll see if some people um in my church will want some i will probably donate some as well but we have honey for days and not only do we have honey for days you guys we also have vinegar for days by the same company here i looked these up on amazon you guys and one bottle one bottle is about $27 just for one bottle, give or take. 20 something dollars for a bottle of vinegar is a lot regardless, right? So to find all of this vinegar, all of this honey, you guys, is an absolute blessing. And I will definitely be putting it to use. And again, shout out to you guys because you guys are always keeping me updated with information. I am always grateful um, for you all. Like I always say, I have the best YouTube supporters on the YouTube platform. And I am so grateful for each and every last one of you. 
Thank you all. All right, you guys. So I saved a lot of money on this honey and vinegar. I went in the house and I did my calculations, you guys. And I am so in shock at how much we saved. All right. So the vinegar, you guys, the white boxes right there, we have six uh, containers of vinegar in each box. And we have a total of 15 boxes, right? That's with the vinegar. So we saved a total of $2,385 just vinegar you guys now the brown boxes that's the honey we have 10 boxes of honey we have 12 uh, honeys in each box we save three thousand nine hundred dollars so all together you guys insane six thousand two hundred and eighty five dollars you guys just in vinegar and honey you guys i am like <laughs> in complete freaking shock at how much I was able to save you guys hold on wait. I'm trying to make sure I don't hear any seepage hold on yep I hear some seeping from somewhere over here you hear it I'm not sure if that's how it's supposed to be. you can tell that they mended it right here hold on let me bring this up Hold on. I hear some air coming from right here. Yep. Now they want they can take this and patch that up right there. But for the most part, it's a pretty good bed if they can patch that up. So I might have to just toss it back out, you guys, because it's a lot of seepage going on on the other side. Now I could possibly list it and say that there is, you know, some sort of leakage and sell it for about a hundred bucks. But here it is, y'all. So guys, that is it. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please do remember to like, comment, subscribe, share. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. Make sure you leave comments down in the comment section because I enjoy interacting with you guys. Also guys, if you are not aware, I have another YouTube channel. And on that channel, guys, you will see my family and I interacting with one another, as well as me doing various things that I decided not to do on this channel. So guys, if you're interested, make sure you look down in the comment section. I left the link for you there. Also, guys, I am a published author. That's right, guys. I have a book, a book, a book, a great book, guys. Um, and I would love for you to check it out. Make sure, guys, you check your local Barnes & Noble. You go on Amazon and look for the title, Finding Your Treasure. And guess what? The book is even an audiobook with Google Play as well as Audible. Again, look under the title, Finding Your Treasure, and you will be able to see my book. And as always, guys, I'll see you guys in the next YouTube video.
I'm on a mission to serve in whatever capacity the Lord sees fit. I had no idea I'd globally impact the world. I took what others threw away and positively changed minds. People in France, Qatar, the Philippines, and other countries are now following me along on this journey.